joining us here this morning. As you see, I'm surrounded by a number of individuals, uh, many of whom are uh, law enforcement officials from throughout the St. Louis area, and we're here to talk about something very important uh, to St. Louis and the state of Missouri, and that is uh, red light cameras. According to the history books, the first traffic light was displayed in London in 1868 to regulate pedestrian and buggy traffic outside of Parliament. Red meant stop, and green meant go. History doesn't record when the first horse and buggy went through a red light, but I'm sure it was soon uh, thereafter. But since then, almost all of us regard the habit of running a red light a dangerous one. Most of us stop at red lights. We assume that other people will as well. Unfortunately, a few people don't. So people get hurt, sometimes very badly. If everyone obeyed the law, we would not need the police. They don't. There are hundreds of intersections in the city of St. Louis and scores of busy ones. At the busiest intersections, thousands of vehicles and pedestrians pass each other every day. Keeping all of them, motorists and pedestrians safe, is an important part of the police department's job. But it is not their only job, and they simply cannot patrol every dangerous intersection at all times. Hence, red light camera enforcement. Red light cameras make intersections safer, safer for drivers and safer for pedestrians. It is obvious in the numbers. After the first few months of a red light camera, the number of violations go down a lot. That means fewer people are running red lights. That means our intersections are safer. That means most drivers change their behavior when they believe there is a risk that they might be caught and fined. It is evidence that they work. That is, for me, the reason to have them and the reason not to make their operation illegal in Missouri. If someone, wasn't, if someone doesn't want to pay a red light ticket, they have a very simple solution. Don't run the red light. It is my very strong wish that the Missouri General Assembly, General Assembly recognize the important role red light cameras play in public safety in our community. I also believe that the Missouri General Assembly should focus on running the state and leave cities in the hands of local elected officials. Thank you. At this time, I'd like to uh, ask uh, Ed Dowd, former U.S. Attorney, to say a few words.